Good morning. Beautiful sunny morning. Walking along one of my favourite little lanes. I might meet people coming the other way, dog walking, which is a plus. But I'd like to talk this morning about acceptance. I'm having to accept things as I'm getting older, as we all do. I have to accept that yeah, I'm still learning and will continue to do, but the rate of dropping off of learning, that seems to be getting a little bit faster. I also have to accept that my eyes aren't as good as they used to be. I have cataracts and that explains why I have to have the, the darker glasses on when I'm outside. Uh, I'm told that they're not bad enough for surgery yet and for once in my life I actually hope that something does get a bit worse so that I can maybe have the surgery and get back to not having to wear yellow glasses to try and expand the time that I can actually drive. At present I can't drive at night. No, it's not that I don't want to. I literally can't. If a car comes the other way, my eyes automatically close. And you know, that's not a good thing when you're driving. But now it's reached a stage that I struggle. I really struggle if the sun is low in the sky. And again, I wear the yellow glasses and they do help a bit. My eyes don't close, I just go to a squint. But if it's been raining and the sun is flickering up off the road, I just can't drive. So I have to accept that. But sometimes it's not a case of acceptance, rather a case of, can I do anything about it? This I can't do anything about until they say surgery is on. But if it's a matter of learning, then yes, I'll learn. If it's a matter of practicing, then I'll practice. And sometimes it might be a matter of spending a bit of money on something. Then for all of us, it's a matter of, can I afford that? Do I really want to? Balance. So it's all down to acceptance or am I using it as an excuse? And no, I'm not using the cataracts as an excuse. I really would love not to be a troglodyte who <laughs> becomes shut away very early on winter evenings or relying on friends to take me to places. And they're so good, they do. But uh, sometimes we have to accept just as I'm accepting that my left arm is beginning to ache. So I'm going to say cheerio for now as I move into a bit of shade so that I can see where I actually have to press 